Hi guys, how you going? Sparring DK here, and I'm here to tell you how to help your favorite YouTube channel grow. Now, why would you want to help your favorite YouTube channel grow? One reason only. You want to watch videos, you want to watch quality, and the only way you can really get to that level is by watching YouTubers that do it for a living. Someone like myself is on 1,300 subscribers by around that mark at the moment, and this is definitely not my full-time job. One day, hopefully, it could possibly be. But in order to be a full-time job, you probably need around 100 to 150,000 subscribers, bare minimum, just to make enough income uh, in daily videos just to support yourself um, and just make it through the day, basically. We, we get a really minuscule amount of commission from all those little adverts that pop up, and that is how we make our money. We don't do it for the money, we do it for the love. Well, I know I do make these videos for fun, and I just want to share the experience with you. But the big guys that do it for a living, they rely on you clicking on your, their videos, clicking on that advert, and uh, that is how they live in the world. So, what can you do to help the YouTube channel grow? First thing you can do is subscribe to the channel. This involves you having your own YouTube account, um, and hitting that subscribe button, and that just lets you know that every time a video from your favorite YouTuber comes along, it's gonna pop up in your subscription base, and you'll be able to click over and watch it. The next thing you need to do is hit that like button. Why do you need to hit that like button? Because likes generate interest, okay? The way YouTube works is it goes off the base of views, likes, and comments. And these all get put into some sort of algorithm, and that's where it pops up on Google higher on the list. So you can go and watch some shit video that's had gone viral, it's had two million views, it's got the right title, and all of a sudden that's gonna pop at the top of Google. But there could be some quality YouTuber that's got 50 subscribers, an absolute cracking video, but no one's seen it because it's on page 63 of Google. So every time you hit that like button, that's helping that video out. What else you can do is leave comments. Comments also add to that algorithm. Now, every time you leave a comment, even if it's just great video or hi or first, as a lot of people like to write, uh, that actually helps the video out. So make sure you leave as many comments as you can. Don't spam it with shit. Uh, but yeah, leave some feedback, say hello, get involved with the community of the videos that you're watching. The next thing you want to do is link your YouTube account to your social media. So if you've got Twitter or Facebook or something like that, there's a way you can link your YouTube so that every time you hit that like button, it'll actually share it on Twitter for you, it'll share it on Facebook for you, and actually help that YouTube channel get a bit more exposure to some of your friends that may have not seen the channel before. Uh, so yeah, you just basically want to share it as much as you can. Put it on your social media if you don't want to link it to your YouTube account. If you you know you find something funny, you paste it on Facebook. Of course you do, but the best thing to do is link it automatically to your YouTube, uh, so that it automatically does it for you. And you're really helping us out by doing that one. Another thing you can do is go and tell your friends. Uh, you may have a guy, you know, your best bloody mate who doesn't know about the cool stuff that you've been watching. Show him. He might enjoy it as well. Get him subscribed. Get him on Twitch, get him on Twitter, get him to flood the, the actual media. And this is gonna give us a, a broader uh, expanse on hitting more targets and letting us grow a lot quicker. The next thing you can do is if your YouTuber has merchandise, I uh, know a lot of the YouTubers out there do have merchandise. If, you, if you've got a spare 20 bucks and you can afford and you wanna buy a t-shirt or a stubby holder or whatever they've got out there, that's still revenue to your YouTuber and that's helping them grow, um, you know, just building them up. And last but not least is donations. Now we don't ask for donations, you know, we're not charity. We're doing this because we love making videos. We like making people laugh. We like being informative. We like bringing things to the world that you can watch. But a donation is always gonna help. We're never gonna say no to money. Um, but by all means, we're not begging for money. We're not a charity. So. That's basically it. Subscribe, use that like button, and comment as much as you can. They're the three main ones. And then if you can share our videos on social media, that will also help us out. Tell your friends, buy merchandise, and if you're that way inclined, donate to the channel. Now, why do we need this cash? Obviously, to live if it's your full-time job, but if you're a low subscribe base like myself, what do I use the money for? I use it to buy better equipment, so that I can make better videos. So that's all it's all, it's just a constant process, you know? You need better equipment so you can make videos quicker and better quality 
And if you can do that, then you can make more videos for you guys to watch at home. That about wraps it up. That's all I really wanted to get off my chest. Just just try and help out your fellow YouTubers. You know, you, you tune every, every day to watch a video. Why not just subscribe to the channel, hit that like button constantly, and leave us a comment and share it to your friends in social media. That's the best way you can help a YouTube channel to grow. That's all I've got to say. I'm Spiring DK. It's five o'clock somewhere. You have a good one.